Hey guys, welcome back to part two of Uncharted 2. Uh, we just left off. Nathan was betrayed by Rat Face Ratfoil and um, was taken out of prison by old friend Sully. Getting back into it. I guess the uh, COVID date's been extended okay. to. Okay, I've planted charges all around 15, the perimeter of the so. camp. You two just need to arm them. The first one should be right Got ahead of plenty you. Plenty of time to enjoy all the old games in the Uncharted library. Here it is. I also left the detonator for you. Uh huh. There we are. All right. First one set. Don't touch the button. This one? <laughs> Once you've set all the charges, just hit the detonator and it's showtime. <laughs> right. know what I want you. Just be careful. The Zarovich has got his men posted all around the perimeter. Just you and me, silly. Setting off bombs in the swamp. Of Borneo. Is he following along? All right. Keep an eye out for the drones. <sighs> I'm sweating like a hooker in church. <laughs> Tell me about it, Sully. Why not? Hooker in church. Wants me to do it by sneaking. Who's there? Oh man, I already fucked it up. I said quiet, Nate. That's the other end of loud. Alright, alright. Well, uh, I'm not gonna be sticky to this one. Nathan Drake, sneaking, not his forte, fort. I don't know the proper pronunciation of that is. You know, some people are good at some things, like sneaking. Other people are good at other things, like climbing around like this. Looks like we can swing across there. All right. Maybe you can. Sounds good. All right, hold on, Grandpa. See if I can find another way up. Jeez, Gramps. Sully, you just pull me out of prison, you know, after being betrayed by some random rat man. But no big deal, Gramps. Alright. Gonna 
jump to this thing over here. There we go. Come on, Nathan. Oh, no, no, what are you doing? No, you're facing the wrong way. No, no, no. Okay. Look at this. Alright. Just what I need. Good job, Sully. Alright. Damn, I'm a good shot. Good job, Nathan. You killed it. You killed him. You killed the man. You killed that man. Good job. Serve it. Have it. Granola bar. You should be getting close to the first camp. I've planted four more charges in there, but you're going to have to clear the place out before you can arm them. Clear the place out of people? What's the point of the charges if, uh, not to get rid of the people themselves? Here's the camp. You ready for this? Let's do it. What else does he expect to find? Don't let Lazarevich hear you talking like that. That's right. Alright, we're stealth again. This time, we're doing it for real. Huh? What was that? That must have been nothing. It must have been a trick of my mind. It's a, a body. Oh. Walking across, and my friend just seems to have disappeared. Ah. But I guess it's no cause for alarm. Ah. places and most painful places they're they're sure to scream out in pain and probably not be very injured <laughs> all right you better check it out yeah better check this out check this out Bunch 
of guys over here, it seems like. Maybe not. I don't see them. Oh, there they are. They're all hiding! Planting explosives somewhere. It's a ladder. Right. Sully needs that. <clears throat>
Nathan. Hey, Nate, we've still got to arm the explosives, remember? Right. Well, where? Okay. Arm the explosives. Somewhere. Arm the explosives. All right, I know that. It's pointing in here. Arm the explosives here. Bullets. Oh, here's an explosive. Okay. All right. Are they armed? I don't know. My favorite part of every game is having no idea what to do. <clears throat> okay, it, the map is pointing me towards... Oh, here we go. Alright. We still got to arm three of the charges. Okay. Where? I guess uh, there's more base arm. If I wander around in circles for long Nate, enough. We've still got to arm the explosives, remember? <clears throat> Where are the explosives at? Oh, here we go. Oh, there's hidden around the base. There should be only two left. Okay. There's <laughs> one. All right, now arm in the explosives. Three out of four. All right, one more, and we're out of here. One more explosive. Where is it? Here it is. <coughs> okay, that's all of them. Now let's go pay Mr. Lazar a a visit. <laughs> Good idea, Sully. Let's go pay Mr. Lazar a visit. Maybe from here. No. That, that ladder looks pretty promising, possibly. Can't reach us. Come on over here. I'll give you a boost. All right. Come on, gorgeous. Jump up. Yep. Uh, 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 got a great ass, Sully. Uh, thanks. <laughs> there you go, kid. All right. Yeah, <laughs> Sully. You nice, nice butt you got there. That's just some that must have tight been some cheeks. Some tsunami to wash these ships so far inland. What's that? Looks 
deserted. A Jeep? Some kind of car. Can we drive it? <clears throat> Whoa. The pop is down again. Uh, the damn thing is always breaking down. Come on, let's just fix it so we can get out of here. Look, they're not armed. Uh, but that money, what are we waiting for? We can take these guys. I don't know, Sully. Maybe. Oh, God, here we go. That was a secret. There's someone here. Nathan, what'd you do? You just fell into the pond. That was easy. That was some pretty good attacks. Oh, we've got more guys. All right. Reaction. Got a action. Could have some help down here. Yeah, you would have been fine. Yeah. Uh, there's another one for you, Sully. Being a ninja, all part of the treasure hunting trade. Enough of this frivolity, kid. Come on, we got work to do. <clears throat> what does frivolity mean? Nathan Drake. Not the greatest vocabulary. Well, we follow the hose. That just adds to his idea. You ideal always follow the hoes. Just like in Montreal, huh? We're never gonna forget that, are you? Just like in Montreal. Why did you know the rope down? Where are we going? I feel like we're gonna go that way. This rope is pointless. Totally. Or not. That way? Alright. Follow your body language. Wait, this is where I came from. This is not where I was just going. Sully, you are leading me astray. I guess we're supposed to go that way. How did you get over there, Sully? Sully was like a ninja. <clears throat> the dig. I think I see the camp up ahead. Where? Down there? Good eyes, Nathan. Okay, you ready? Wait, wait, just hold on a sec. Ah. Trisha. Three months and you have found nothing. Well, 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 now wait, wait a minute. We've been commander. That must be Lazarevich. This man was caught stealing artifacts from site number five. <laughs> you would betray me for this? No, no, Zoran, I can't explain. No, no need, no need. <laughs> Lazarovich. No, you do it. You want it next? And false. No? Okay, I'll give you really the way. This you guy's go. day. Do it. Run out! Search for perimeter! Go! Alright, it's all yours, kid. I'll come yeah. here from there. Like fish in a barrel. Some fool left a sniper rifle up here. Oh, careful. Oh. Looks like they left a couple of sentries behind. Okay, kid. It's showtime. Yes. The shin attack. The ultimate stealth move. Alright. I guess I'm gonna shoot you. Oh, I can still hit you. 
is not paying us enough of this shit. All right. This is fine. Come over here. Like a ninja. All right. What's this? Come on, guys. it up yet. Let's use it. It's very... There is oh, This Lazarevich guy isn't screwing around, Sully. You should see all this stuff. He's got files on every expedition to find Shambhala. All the way back to the 1600s. What about Marco Polo's journals? <laughs> this guy's not they are. Just hurry it up, you haven't got much time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The worthy pilgrim is granted a golden passport to conquer obstacles on his journey to Shambhala. Huh. Is that supposed to mean something? Beats me. Hold on. Here we go. It was with great sorrow that I left my fellow travelers to their fate. A fate decreed by the dreadful cargo we bore from Shambhala. You must have thought that tsunami was some kind of divine retribution. Wait a minute. Damn. Sully, I don't think the Chintamani Stone is here. What? Listen to this. I, I would have what? sooner endured the wrath of Kublai Khan himself than remove the Chintamani stone from that sacred shrine. Marco Polo never had the stone. Then what dreadful cargo is he talking about? I don't know. Well, if the stone's not here, what the hell is this arm? It's looking for. This sense. Marco Polo, what were you doing? Shambhala. Here in Borneo? He's a little wide of the mark, don't you think? He must be trying to pick up Marco Polo's trail back to Shambhala. Why? <laughs> because the stone is still there. <sighs> Chloe, can you talk? Hold on. Yeah, I'm here. In all this digging they've done, have they found any bodies, any remains at all? No, now that you mention it, nothing. Why? <laughs> Over 600 people were shipwrecked here, yet there's no bodies. Don't you find that a little odd? So where did they all go? Where would you go if a tsunami hit? To higher ground. Bingo. We head to that mountain. What do you bet we find Marco's pals? Chloe, can you meet up with us? Already on my way. Great. Uh-oh. Nate, you gotta get out of there. <laughs> You're gonna have to give me a minute, Sully. You don't have a minute. What's it? They're all dead. Oh, crap. Right out. Stay down, kid. I got you covered. Nate. Uh, you well, that's convenient. All right. Throw, throw grenades. L2, tap L1. What? That's a horrible system. Alright. Who uses their middle finger to hold the trigger? Alright, there we go. Freeze! Millions of men and 
enlisted by Lazarovich <coughs> to hunt for Shambhala and all of them are willing to put their lives on the line. They're trying to flank us! Just about had it with these guys. There's someone here. They're closing in on me. Okay, I'll rescue you, Sully.
throw this grenade in there. Should be this way. You need anything easily. It's kind of extensive to make, though. There's a lot of steps involved. You gotta make the pie crust and fill in separately. I mean, I'm just saying, it's much easier. Sully. Together. Look at these stones. Uh, like cookies. Pies are like twice as complicated. You want to get the crust right. It's even <laughs> harder. You know, it's like you can have a basic crust, but you know, you want to go all out. You get like the flaky crust. You know, there's a. Would you look at that? A lot of oh, yeah. skill involved in making a pie. Hey. I don't understand that expression. Hello. What do we have here? With any luck, the last resting place of Marco Polo's crew. Shall we check it out? No right. Oh, this place must be thousands of years old. At least. It's too dark. No flashlight? Can't see a thing. Down this way. Okay. Oh. Looks like we hit the jack. Ugh, there must be hundreds of bodies down here. Look at their teeth. They're all black. I think they're all that way. They must have. Oh. Ah! Ah! Hey, I think I found something. In here. What? I've seen this before. Expression should really be easy as cake. Or easy as Sully, cookies. Give me a light. Those are much easier to make than pie. Oh. Ah. Uh, Wait a minute. This is blood. It's everywhere. Looks like a real massacre. All right, let's follow the blood stains. We'll see if they lead All somewhere. Right. I guess uh, this is it. <clears throat> hmm. Did I lose the blood stains? It's a little hard to tell. Is that the blood? Okay. Blood's there. Stains. Going in circles. All the blood stains. Blood stains gotta be here. Blood. To here. Where's this light coming from? 
blood stains to this spot. Maybe along this wall. Alright, if I just scour the perimeter, there's no way that I'll miss whatever it is that I'm supposed to find here. To end at this wall. Yeah. Alright. That's odd. This moves a little. Sully, help me out. Go again with the pushing. The trail leads in here. More bodies. You know, maybe I'm crazy, but it looks like they all killed each other. Come on, Nate. She... You just oh get this. It's a basket. Wow. Look at this. What do we have here? Well, well, <laughs> well. Marco Polo. Ah! 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 Mighty. Oh, Nate. Just kidding. Nate, you're gonna give me a goddamn heart attack. Oh. Man, is that an ugly friggin' thing? What is it? Some kind of weapon? No, no, it's a, a perba. It's a ritual object from Tibet. It's used to destroy obstacles. Huh? You know, spiritual ones. Oh. Wait a minute. Wait, could this be what Marco Polo was talking about? Kid, I don't even know what the hell you're talking about. <laughs> In his journal, he wrote that uh, the worthy seeker would be given a golden passport to conquer obstacles on the journey to Shambhala. So, what, this is it? Look, that's all really interesting, but where the hell is it a passport to? Well, maybe this map would help. Let me see that. <laughs> Between Greater India and the province of Tibet lies a field of exquisitely finished temples. Hundreds of gilded spires stretching as far as the eye can see. Hold on, I know this place. It's in Nepal. Yeah. Except it's not just a field of temples anymore, it's a city. Well, that could make things a little more challenging. Now, hold on, there's more. In all these many temples, only one conceals the secret path to Shambhala. And that path shall only be revealed to the pilgrim who bears the golden passport. All <laughs> right, nice work, kid. So what are we waiting for? <laughs> Let's get out of here. All right. See ya. Later, skeleton man. Let's get going. chances that we are not going to be waylaid by Dimitri I'm gonna go out and make sure the coast is clear. I'll see you in a bit. Rat face bitch. Rat face rat foil. Give me a hand, Nate! Come on. Harry! In here! It's Drake! Oh my god. What the hell are- Get your hands up. What a surprise! Oh, come Shut up, sorry. Should've known it was you. Rat face, rat foil. <laughs> and you. Again. Victor, goddamn Sullivan. You still dragging this tired old sack of shit around? Easy, Nate. That's pretty ballsy for a guy who spent the last three months behind bars. Better than pissing away three months in the jungle without a clue. Found the ships, though, didn't I? Couldn't find your own ass with both hands. And a map. They came from down there. This is the quick quips oh. that uh, ideal man, Nathan. Harry, Drake. look at this. 
and Sully. Speaking of Sullivan. maps, between Even India and Tibet, the one temple will there. reveal a it pathway to eyes. Shambhala. Jesus, Flynn, while we're young. Oh, no. don't be such a bad sport. Take them to Lazarevich. You're gonna wish you'd stayed in prison, mate. Move. Rat foil and rat, rat Athena. The rat. Come on, keep moving. <sighs> <sighs> Oh, I had no oh, faith. Shit. Are you all right? Yeah, well, Maybe. it'll make it look more believable. Maybe I spoke too soon. I'm going to try and buy you some time. I feel a little bad about that. No, Chloe, you have Fina, to come with us. No. You surprised me. Just meet me in Nepal. Now run. Let's go. I like her. Yeah, I bet you do. Shit, we're all on the side of things. I'm fine! I'm fine! I'm fine! I mean, we could just take him out. Kill thousands. What? Run! Ah! Oh. 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 Shit! Right. They've spotted us! I'm fine! So, he wants me to run. But, uh, I guess I gotta spin and go around him. Oh. Jump! Oh, hold on there, son bitch. You gotta be out of your mind. We'll break our goddamn necks. Yeah, if we get caught, Lazarevich will break them for us. I'm getting too old for this bullshit. No, come on now, don't you start this again. Listen, I don't have your luck. Guys like me gotta know when to walk away from the table. Sully, we're gonna get out of this, okay? We always do. Yeah. So like you go meet your girl in Nepal. I'm going somewhere warm. Come on. Hey, you can tell me all about it when you get back. Well, shall we? After you, Butch. See you in hell, kid. <laughs> Shit. Cowabunga. Well, when you said Lazarevich had a head start on us, you weren't kidding. Well, he's had some help from the local guerrillas. The city's been on the brink of civil war for years. He just needed to throw a little gasoline on the fire. Charming. Yeah, well, all the chaos provides some cover while he destroys the city looking for the right temple. Nate? Hello? Yeah, I'm still here. You're not having second thoughts, are you? Oh, no, me? Never. Good, because I'm so ready to be done with these clowns. You got a map? Uh... Yeah. I'll meet you in the old market. Things are pretty quiet over there. All right, you got it. Uh-oh. I got company. Oh, great. Can you lose them? I think it might be too late for that. Come on. Nate, are you all right? I've been better. tuned for part three thanks for tuning in the amazing adventures of nathan drake in the times of covid see you later